Hey guys, I'm SKV and you're watching SKV Plays On and welcome to Conan Exiles. This is the Isle of Sifter DLC map related gameplay. Episode number 9 or something. Uh, kind of finished up with most of the building aspect of the Dragon Cliff base and also kind of connected a few other cliffs or actually one more cliff kind of connected it with the bridge and got rid of one of the elevators the horizontal one because I just ended up making a bridge either way but I think I'll also make a elevator on the side uh, just in case someone breaks the support beams at the bottom anyways uh, for those of you who might be new to the channel hope you guys also enjoy the gameplay and for those of you who are regulars of the uh, Conan Exile gameplays again hope you guys also enjoy the gameplay and I'll start it off and if you do enjoy the gameplays you know what to do please do leave a like so that it kinda helps promote the videos for those of them who may not know about my channel and of the games that I do play like them just for entertainment anyways here we go starting it off I am a bit gloomy today or should I say the weather is a bit cloudy and I'm feeling a bit lazy but hopefully the gameplay might change things or if something of a crash happens then probably I'll get annoyed and let's see that also is a uh, change from my laziness I guess I don't know I'm just talking something right now uh, you know that I'm lazy when I start talking and mumbling something or the other that's the intro this is the first start of the day I love sipped up the wallpaper or the screen the loading screen that you're seeing is from Savage Wilds it's probably inside a type of a volcano mountain kind of a deal I don't know Seems like it. Lots of gorillas in this area. Although I'm not on that particular map right now. I'm on Isle of Scepter. So, yeah. Speaking of which, 21st June, it seems like they're gonna give more info about uh, the Conan Exile update. Maybe 3.0 update. It just has a wallpaper that says, um, what is it? power something power requires or power needs sacrifice or something like that sacrifices it said I don't know let's see what they're going to introduce into the 3.0 update and I do use mods did verify the files so it is going to take a little time every first start of the game is a bit slow yeah. yeah first loading session of the game also some of the mods have been getting some updates some fixes every day so I had to verify quite a bit of the files before I started off uh, Age of Calamitous mod has been getting quite a few fixes, quite a few, yeah, actually quite a few fixes each day, so I am still yet to go and check whether I can continue, although I don't know if I will, if history is to... Oh, there we go loaded into the game uh, I did kind of change a few things upstairs on the other side where I had made the elevator in the previous stream I kind of had to destroy the other things and then made it all the way at the top of that one ruin tower that was there next to the cliff and let's see I will show you just a second just waiting for the usual. I usually wait the first uh, start of the day of Conan Exiles. I just let it load in whatever 
it's loading or reading data 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 something to start off and voila that's what I've been up to a bridge going there from there to there from there to there also, if I'm not wrong, if I remove the support or something, the bridge should be intact, I think. At least that's what I remember. As long as the ends are connected, the bridge stays intact is what I remember. This is part of the uh, last construction and more and more. I did put some fences as well. too close oh jeez ooh crap that was bad that was really really close too uh, could you climb correctly please oh come on you gotta be able to climb. There we go. Much better. And stop.
also made a few changes up top other than this over here Come on, dude. I already verified it. Why are you doing this to me? Oh, starting it again, just so anyone is watching. Uh, it's going to be a bit loud at the beginning. The cutscene of the uh, game. Stone and Exiles. Just give me a second. Just in case anyone's using headphones, uh, I'm restarting the game, it just crashed. Even though I verified the files, it's telling me to verify it again. Do verify it. Stop game files. First, they took your family and your riches. Then they took your health and your pride. Finally, they left you to die. What will you do, Exile, when there is nothing left but to live or die? What will you become? Okay, now that we are back, let me get this on the screen now. And we can get back to whatever gameplay. I have no idea what I want to do. I just wanted to kind of see where to place all the workstations today. Because every place uh, is kind of capable of uh, holding quite a few workstations. But for some workstations, I do have to see if I have any points. 
I don't think I have too many points though, so I may have to kind of see if I can reach like level 60. Level 60 is the only time when I am able to, well, kind of use the fragment of power to be able to get some feet points. Other than just ranking up, I can also get points from the fragment of power, tablet of power, whatever. I do have quite a bit of them from the enemy drops. Just gonna wait for a bit. That should be enough of a weight. I'm gonna start off. I'm supposed to take this out. Do this. If I take out this one, something's gonna break here. Oh uh, boy. Okay, whatever. Yep, thought so. This place looks perfect for a workstation area, like 
proper and also at the bottom over there I'm thinking of making like a I don't know just quite a few foundations at the bottom place randomly so that uh, that one is the thing that the purge chooses to attack and not the thing at the top I still have enough time I think but if I start doing dungeon runs now that's going to change very quickly also speaking of which I do have to unlock quite a few of the workstations like improved workstations and I don't have points for it mm. I may have to do a dungeon run to be able to get the points. Uh, kinda wanted to unlock this. Which is way too far away. I still need to... Uh, yeah, I definitely need to reach like level 60 or something. To be able to get those. Mm. Oh, Maelstrom already started? Uh oh. Oh, anyways, I think it's time for me to kind of destroy whatever materials and building pieces I have and get back the resources from it. Oh, also, I did make a few changes all the way at the top. Let me show you. Mm hmm. Made a few changes. Used the uh, storm glass slopes because they have glasses on it. I could have used the glass construction and more mod itself, but that one kind of unlocks very late into the game. That one right there. I need level 64 or something. Yeah, <laughs> way too far away. Yep, yep, yep. Quite a bit far away right now, so. Glass bender. Eh. But then again, the storm glass already had a bit of glass in it, so I made use of it. And the sun does get through it, which is good. I did leave a few of the openings as it is. It's not gonna rain in here anyway, or on this particular map. There's no rain, which is something interesting. So, kind of made use of that to have some openings in the ceiling as well, or in the roof. gonna be the throne room that's going to be something I don't know that one I kind of want it to be the workstation place or I'm kind of thinking this could be like the throne room or something pretty open wide open but then it's so spacious that I thought maybe I'll place all the workstations here neatly but then again hmm 
if I start making all the improved workstations, it's going to be a bit more bigger. Oh, hey, Chris. Uh, you don't have the DLC? How do you make a purge proof single player base? Purge proof? Uh, you can always craft whatever you want and then separately make another uh, area with a lot of foundations on it. And the purge probably will target the last thing that you crafted. At least for me, that's been the case till now. Uh oh, one second. Where's my fence? Uh, that's not the fence I'm looking for. Oh man, last fence. Uh, boy. But yeah, usually the purge only targets like uh, the last thing that you crafted. Not enough contact about now so yeah uh, I usually try to make something of a uh, like same similar circular foundation or actually a square foundation would work and then inside I would usually just uh, place a, a what do you call it um, wheel of pain the level 3 wheel of pain pretty much and since this place is all the way up and I've also not given a proper uh, you know uh, pathway leading downstairs they might start spawning on top so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a separate uh, building or separate base only for the purge down there and I'll probably keep a few thralls over there or something and then connect a ramp to the top of that small hill down there so that the purge will target that towards the end and not this but either which way if it does target this place I have made it in such a way that if they spawn on top of the roof or something they do slide off because these are well some of them will slide off because this type of a uh, wedge shaped slope it doesn't give you any you know uh, friction to stand on if you stand on this it just pushes you off the side so I've done that so it should kind of work but then again I have used tier 3 materials for the foundation so if they do break anything it's probably just the flotsam pieces that should be okay but I am going to do the separate foundations and all that downstairs that's gonna help me try to keep them away from this base uh, you wanna make a map room at each of the obelisks oh I don't want a purge uh, attacking the map rooms. Oh, you can always, uh, what do you call it? Um, after making the map room or something, uh, just close to the map room or something, or a bit far away from the map room, maybe make another like foundation or something that uses more amount of, uh, you know, building pieces compared to the map room i think you should be able to kind of get them away from your map room usually the game is always trying to find your biggest base or whatever or the last base that you created from what i saw recently because i've even noticed that after finishing the base if you make any changes towards the end that's what they're going to target And also, it probably also depends on how many building pieces you've used in that area. This one, as you can see, everything is connected. So this one counts as a bigger base compared to whatever I do downstairs. Uh, that's why I'm thinking maybe I should m make another base somewhere else. I'm trying to see if I can make a base close to the dragons. So that even if a purge happens, I'm not usually into capturing purge thralls much, even if a named one shows up. 
and it's a very rare one too I usually just uh, try to take them out because I don't want them destroying my building pieces but yeah for me to even do that right now Hmm, what if they don't go after this base and go after my like level 1 base or something? The one that I made over there, the first one. That's what I'm worried about. I need to shift all the things that are there over there to here. But how? Making a cliff base and all, I did it, but... Now I'm kind of worried how the purge is going to act. Mm. I guess I might as well start off making the things downstairs. Hopefully I don't get attacked by anything. Also I kind of want to make a horizontal elevator here as well just in case they do destroy this at the bottom the supports which shouldn't make the bridge fall down because that one's part of the glass construction and more mods so like a roller coaster or something <laughs> except we don't have loops that go like sorry to cha throw a wrench in your chain well it's okay I always have issues with the purge the last time I had a purge was on exile lands when I was uh, playing the age of calamitous mod related gameplay and they did not come to the new base that I constructed. They went to the older base that I had at the at the lower level. Uh, this was near to the Witch Queen uh, area, and turned out that that one had more building pieces compared to the current base, and it got attacked. Luckily, nothing was left behind. So, yeah, there should be some gameplay. It happened during the stream itself, so. This one, I kind of want to make a base downstairs, but there's a Sand Reaper down there, if I'm not wrong. Is that the Sand Reaper? There are some crazy parrots also down there. Wonder how this is going to turn out now. Well, I do need to equip some weapons just in case. Oh, here we go. Going straight down. Ooh, ooh, ooh careful. Oh jeez! <laughs> Every time fall from this side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, 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 I know. Okay, you got me there. Okay, you got me there again. Okay, only these things were there. Where's the Sand Reaper? Pretty sure there was a Sand Reaper up here. Or did I place the support beams in the place that the Sand Reaper spawns? That should be. Purge broke your first base uh, had at Oasis of... Oh, north of Sepulmeru. Feel like a week's worth of gathering building makes me want to rage quit. 
Well, that that's true. Uh, if you're on servers and you're uh, doing a bit of a grind. Uh, hello, dragon. Yeah, I know you saw me. But right now... So this is where I'm gonna be making the ramp or something that leads downstairs. So that even if any purge kinda shows up, they kinda attack this place first. What, you saw me? Yeah, well, you don't breathe fire, remember? You're a land dragon, green one. The other ones breathe fire. The red one. Yeah, that's right. You only do the tailspin attacks as much as possible. Relax. You think I'm gonna put a ramp at the beginning? I'm gonna put it at the end so that you don't climb up here. Slightly towards this side. I said, relax. Uh, high enough? Should be. Should be enough. That didn't turn out correctly, did it? Eto... Hmm, did not. Okay, what did I do, stupid? This one's a random thing that I'm building here, so yeah, shouldn't really be much of an issue.
relax and go away. I'm not here to fight you, you crazy. <laughs> yeah, 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 I know, I know. Need to pick that up. Uh, you go away. On fibers. Thanks for the interaction. I've already subbed and liked. Thank you, Chris. Uh, watched you, watched a YouTube, uh, what's the YouTube? If, start with a column and uh, Place 90 foundations around it and build inside the perimeter. A purge won't attack it. Oh, that one, I think I've seen it. Is it from. Uh. Whack. Something. Something. A YouTuber for Conan Exiles. But that one's a bit old, isn't it? They changed a few things after the update 2.5 or something, if I'm not wrong. Uh, related to the part would you go away go away not interested thank you keep showing up every now and then thing just jumped up are you kidding? are you kidding me I'm hoping that thing does exactly what it just did when the purge happens over here at least I'm hoping the purge happens here what 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 yeah no you're you're crazy oh boy I didn't even get to finish the thing yet okay so the thing I need to do now is so wondering why I'm making so many foundations. Well, I don't want to take any chances of the purge missing out on this bit of a building that I've created especially for them No, I'm out of resources already. Okay, where did I leave the resources now? Oh yeah, oh 
yeah, 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 yeah. I need to go back. I really can't get into trouble with these guys right now. To find a way to run all the way towards that place. Chasing me, I hope. Okay, good, good. You had all the things I needed. Do you have all the things I needed? What am I missing? Hardened bricks? Is it? Is it hardened bricks? Yeah, seems like it. Yep, hardened bricks. Nice. Oh, no, geez. back only one for everything that I wasted to now. Luckily they made the changes where you get everything that's stacked on top of each other as well if you break down the one supporting it at the bottom. Ah, enough of the bricks now. At least, yeah, kind of. Enough now. Really hope I don't run into anything now. Uh oh. Pick up. Pick up. Uh oh. He's seeing in this direction. Oh hey Red, any ARK survival players? Probably. Oh yeah, uh, did you know you're getting ARK survival for free now? Uh, up until, I don't know what date, this month something something. Uh, just check out if uh, you wanna get ARK survival evolved for free. Uh, it's available on Steam I saw. Where is it? All the way there, I didn't have too much of it. What? What? Just let me do my thing, you crazy. They keep coming. <laughs> Where's the stairs? Stairs, stairs, stairs. You leave me alone with crazy things.
Okay, the big one is a problem right now. I don't think I can fit the big wheel of pain here, can I? I mean, I don't want to, but as long as the wheel of pain is here, I could always get some thralls from that spot. But I'm not gonna be using the wheel of pain mostly for the purge. I don't know if this one is too, I don't know. I'm hoping this one gets targeted because it's more closer to the ground and connected. Well, after I connect it to the ground. You already got it, so you're asking? Well, yeah, me, Ezio, and also Dragon got it. As well, Red. Hmm. I think I know how to... didn't see me. That's a good thing, right? Yeah. <laughs> Please uh, leave me alone, na na na. What? That's oh, I'm gonna get into trouble. See how easily they get star okay you know what let me let me get some friends for you to play with shall we there we go got you some friends yeah 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 enjoy the friends now There we go, yeah! Enjoy now. Well, I work. I work here.
Oh jeez. Run, 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 run. No, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. I'm so in trouble. Uh. Whoa. <laughs> that freaked me out a little bit. And this one's here. What are you doing here? Oh, what the? Wait, I didn't give you the stairway for you. For you to run around that thing? Why the heck is a giant dragon using my stairway? D -d -d -d. Eh. It's a bit too much. All of a sudden. I really need to make a wall on that side. What is this guy? Stupid thing. The other one who got me into trouble. Come here. Yeah, keep moving. I need a few walls over here. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Put that away. Where is a door when you need one? Ah, oh, there you are. That should be good enough. I hope he won't be able to get through this. Even if he sees me. But I'm out of resources again. Ah. Fine, I gotta make some resources. When did the big one start moving around here? As soon as I made this, he started moving around here. Okay, this is not gonna get me anywhere. I really need to run around, get some resources done. Also speaking of which, I should be able to make a furnace. Yeah. And then, I need to go get the stones and consolidant to be able to make the hardened bricks. Uh oh. What did I just do? No, no, no. No! I permanently fixed the light onto myself. Ah oh, man, now I have to use the admin to get rid of it. Ah, chuck it. For now, I'll just leave it. Changed my mind. I changed my game to admin privileges. Can't wait in real life time. 22 hours for a name troll to some. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Exactly. I have a few. Well, I kind of keep most of the things like default combat related at least. Uh, but some other things as a single player definitely changing the server settings to whatever. What was I supposed to do again? Oh yeah, changing the server settings definitely helps uh, for a single player at least. I don't mess with the uh, amount of damage I do or the amount of damage the enemy does. I leave it at defaults, and I enjoy the default gameplay also. But some crafting related stuff, that one I speed it up so that uh, boy. Uh, Oh 
run 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 something starts chasing me i can hear fast thumping sounds on the ground <laughs> you, you shut off the purge itself <laughs> well, that's one way to get things done yeah you don't need the purge anymore <laughs> you completely shut down the purge itself that's that's better I guess will take this as well with me, right? <laughs> no, leave me alone, crazy. Not in the mood to fight you right now. Oh, he's too fast. Oh gee, <laughs> he went right through the gate. What the? And now where'd he go? I wonder if the dragon can go through the gate that easily. Even though it's just a small door. Blocking it. Fix it when I get a proper base. Yup, that works. Hmm. What is this thing doing here? No way. I put so many foundations, yet these things are still there. things I have right now. How long is this gonna take? Might as well unlock some beats. I do need this. Eleven six I don't have enough points oh my god 12 12 okay this one I can unlock but then I gotta unlock this which is 11 points oh man I really need to reach like level 60 soon I guess I'll start doing dungeons then that would kind of help things along. what what I'm gonna see if you can actually get through. Holy! Oh jeez! How did you get through the door? What, you have a pathway so you can go? Really? Okay, luckily he can't climb on that rock at least. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Crap, that thing can climb. Uh, I really need to make one wall at least. 
you come here up there I think that wall should at least block it maybe I don't know let me see if that blocks it oh you crazy you see me you see me here yeah let's see you get through this now Okay, he gets through everything. Oh crap, that's not good. No, 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 no. <laughs> Go away. Go away, okay. That is not at all good. I gotta block this off for now. Yeah. So that he doesn't know I'm up here. Sheesh. But I guess it works. He definitely gets the attention of anything that's on that. If the purge does happen, it should happen over there. I may kinda include a few more foundations or whatever see if the purge kind of happens in that spot now let me see if he actually goes through that wall yeah yeah Yes, he doesn't go through it. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he doesn't go through it. Okay, that works. For now, at least. I guess. Which means the NPCs, the, the purge NPCs probably will follow the same path. I just have to make a door on that day. Or... Maybe not. I don't know. I'll just leave it as it is. Connect it that way and probably finish up making a house up here. Right. Then. I actually want to see if uh, I don't have points to even experiment on this one right now. What is it? Oh wait, wheel of pain, wheel of pain, wheel of pain. What all do I need? Okay, bricks. Oh, come on, I just used up the bricks. Just used up the. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, don't use that. Uh, 25 of it did I need? Yeah, there we go. Property. Let's see if I can fit it over. Oh, yeah, this works. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. This actually works. means I'm gonna make it over here I 
I should have made it this way. No. No, no, no. Hey. Waste uh, of materials because uh, I did not think this through. Really need to get some stone here. Keep showing up every time. Ow. Hey, just give me a second, stupid. missing shaped wood oh. uh -huh. shaped wood is what I was missing can craft it till here. Oh. And completely cover it off and then place one uh, whatever wheel of pain in here. Maybe I don't know if it's big enough for the map room. Uh, Wait a minute, I don't need a map room, do I? Nope. Not really, I'm not this map. Wow. 
Why I'm making foundations instead of ceilings? So that there's more building pieces here compared to the top floor. Well, now which resource is missing? I got this. Uh, bricks. Uh. Seriously? And this guy is walking around here as well. Don't have any supply crates either. Oh, time to destroy quite a few things now just to get how many? One, two, three, four, and five foundations. How much is five foundations? Seven bricks. Oh boy. Support beams also. Wait, support beam requires. Yep, hardened brick as well. And I forgot how much I've been crafting up top. One more. Oh, there we go. That should finish it up. And done. Uh, now to clear out all this. so much already how am I still over encumbered oh 50 okay I guess for now at least that would be the center right there did another one show up okay that kind of works for now I think I'll be able to make any elevator down here. Yeah, now you can see me dragon. 
but I guess for now, since I have very less of the materials, yeah, okay, I'm done with this side. I'm gonna get out of here now. Hopefully, I don't get chased by that thing. I'm gonna get rid of uh, most of the things here and also all the things in my inventory one by one. And I think I'll just dump it into the large chest over there. And then let's go do one dungeon run. Which dungeon do I go to? This is the closest one here. Um. On the right side, uh, do we go to the wolf dungeon? That would be pretty good. I still haven't gone to the center yet. And the maelstrom keeps uh, making sure of that. There are some trolls here. I could try to get some trolls over... Wait a minute. Something saw me? Oh. You. That's a long way up now. Nah, I'm just gonna run. I'm gonna make a run for it. Although I'm losing a lot of health, I might get one shot. them chasing me you are over encumbered yeah well how <gasps> what wait why is it so slow looks so much more peaceful up here Still not... <laughs> I'm missing the things that I need now. Ah, fine. Come here. What are the things I need to get rid of? I'm just gonna dump it out. Materials. Mm. Need everything. Night blue flower seeds, I don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Aurora herb also I don't need it right now. Schematic fragment. Skeleton key, yeah. Okay, it's blah blah blah. Truncheon, yes. I'll be going and trying to get some trolls now. Most of it is here, it's of all the unwanted things, so...
make this work for me. I could just dump it, but uh, it'll be a waste of all the materials I used to craft it in the first place, so... of power cuts has been happening. Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Uh, careful. Almost fell off. Now what?
Yeah, I know this part is a bit boring to watch, but still, gotta get it done, otherwise I'll forget and, yeah. While doing all this you kinda get to see different whatever designs that you could make using these. I mean look at this. Weird designs. the resources are back and now I gotta get back and leave all those resources in one of that now I have to decide which one is going to be my workstation area this one or that one I feel like this could be the workstation area this is going to be the furnace area or i could make this the kitchen area completely yeah, I'll be stacking up quite a bit of exotic. Okay, that will be the kitchen. Put a dining table here. Done. Um, and then... Which one to be the throne room? That one or that one? Hmm. This one feels more appropriate for a throne room. Very... Sturdy. That one seems like it might get uh, <laughs> kind of taken away by a tornado, a maelstrom even. This one feels like a cozy little throne room. Yeah, this one can be a cozy little throne room here. That one definitely is going to be a workstation area or I could make this itself a workstation place I don't know everything seems so possible or probably best to try keeping some of the things away from each other this whole place feels like a proper spot for a workstation area Mm. 
I think I'll keep this itself as a workstation area. Feels wide enough, easy to place all the. Yeah. I think I'll make this the workstation area. I don't know. Uh, if I am going by the by the movies that I've seen or any TV series that I've seen, this one feels more like a throne room or some type of a nice open kind of a deal or a wide space where there's a huge gathering like a throne room, similar to a throne room. But I also see a nice place for all the workstations here. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna make this the throne room and that one itself is the workstation area right here. Since all this is more sturdy, that way even if the purge happens, they're not gonna get through this place that easily compared to that open area if they do spawn here somehow this place kind of feels right furnace Blacksmithy, carpenter's table. Nope, this still feels small. I'm probably gonna use one stove. Probably quite a few freezers because I am going to need a lot of preservation boxes. Once I start grinding for the exotic feast that I'll be giving some thralls. I think here I'll leave some thralls, all the thralls just a place to stay, I'll leave them here. Mm. Even the horse mount? No. <laughs> Actually those mounts I need to find a spot for them. Oh, I think I'll make a stable down there. Yeah, that, that kind of works. I can always go towards that side and pick up the mounts and go. Leave the thralls here. A bit of extra work. Mm, but I guess I have been playing a very cozy game up until now. Now I'm going to make it a bit more annoyingly hard. Even for small things. Look at this, so much of a run just to get to a workstation area or whatever. And this one feels more cozy for a throne room but I guess I'll be making the workstation here itself. Uh, over there, I'll see what to do. I'm thinking some of the um, armor smithy is going to fit here, tanner table, tan, tanning, whatever, uh, carpenter's table, furnace, furnace, yeah.
armor smithy can be here carpenter's table also or should I give each and every uh, workstation a separate designated area so that if I need something I have to go to that spot I could make the top floor the alchemy lab but the problem is it's right under <laughs> under this place where my bed is ah uh, nah uh, uh. actually yeah this one this one could be a nice uh, alchemy type i'll make this a bit more of a library ish and a bit more uh, alchemy uh, related in this area itself Let's see how that turns out. I have to unlock quite a few decorations now. Okay, okay. And then down here, I could kind of make it like a living room situation. Maybe. I have to get some inspiration from some other uh, places. This one can be a throne room itself, simple. A few chairs here, a few chairs here, and a throne chair here. Get a good view on the right and left. out yeah okay decided this is gonna be the kitchen area dining table yeah. and that being the throne room that being the library and hall and alchemy area in this building is probably alchemy is what is going to blow up the building if I do something stupid and then this gonna be all the other workstations like carpenter's bench and armor smithy tanner's table furnace problem is if I make the alchemy over there Okay, yeah, I can make it here. What I need to do now is make sure I have a bit of that. Let's see. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, I'm do. This one here is definitely gonna be more towards the furnace type of uh, situation over here if I can unlock the furnaces that I'm thinking of then I should be able to kind of get one of the bigger furnace that has like a chimney kind of going through the roof like that because it's going to produce some smoke animations and all that, so that's going to look nice. All the other things can go here. 
tanner carpenter and tanner over here oh I can place all the planters here then outside I'm probably gonna use only the aloe and maybe a few other plants Island berries, oh yeah, I need to make a planter over there as well, in that kitchen area. Quite a bit of a grind I have up ahead for myself. Okay, time to go do one dungeon run, see if I can get a little bit of a rank up. Hopefully level 46 maybe. Wait, 47 has something... 47, 47... Level 47 unlocks what? No. Stores at level 55, the improved one. I think I'll be doing quite a bit of the dungeon runs today, just to rank up a little bit. Probably by tomorrow I'll try to reach level 55. Off stream at least. Oh, that helps. Vaults. To store all the things. Uh, lots of points is going to be used up, but that's fine, that's fine. I just need a spot to store all these things. Which of course is going to be in the main house. Where is it? Oh, right here. I guess. This is going to be where I'm going to store it. But to craft the mini vault also, the big vault, no way I'll be able to fit it over here. The mini vault, I can fit it over here, but where the heck am I supposed to craft the mini vault here now? the artisan table to make the mini vault. Ah, oh, why did I come here now? I'm gonna be in so much trouble. Nothing's chasing me? Okay. looks cool and it's all disappearing <laughs> all these things I have to shift now Steel reinforcements. Steel. And 
bricks, steel reinforcement. Uh, do I have to use the ones I have? Okay. Best to take this one along. Oh, there's uh, quite a few stones. I need to get ice now if I'm to make a uh, quite a few things. Windy it's gonna be here if it was in real life up top all the way here how much of a windy situation it would be Got to get it from the horse. Where am I going? Yeah, this is going. <laughs> this is going to be very, very much so. Building something like this, I've already done it. But running around like this every time is going to be annoying later on in the long run. But I guess I have to start planning things before leaving, before doing anything.
Auto. I can't place it on this. Okay. Oh. Did I make that torch? I'm wondering to make this one. Make this one instead. One. Yeah, much better. Look at that. to be something that I can interact with. Able to access this from outside as well, seems like. 
I may have to choose a double wall area. actually use this oh you gotta be kidding me once I'm I placed it I can't pick it up that's not what I want come on ah hate you It doesn't go out of this at the back. Does it keep going out? Got some scout reports, kilos armor. Hey, 
these are from the uh, bosses I didn't check this at all wait this one is Kilos armor when did I get this song of iron all these things when did I get this is it when I fought the bosses I didn't even check I thought it was just some random uh, huh I didn't know the bosses dropped this. Aloe Lemurian. Pride of Acer. Wait, Pride of Acer. Which boss did I fight that was a Nordheimer? Oh, wait a minute. Here. The, there was some camp that does not show up on the map, right? Last time we got a legendary weapon. I'd gone there again. Did that... Uh, that one looks like... Uh, that boss actually wears a Acer armor. So I'm guessing... The one who gave me this axe, legendary axe from that camp... Is the one that gave me the... Pride of Acer. I learned it now. Skelos armor. I don't know where I got the Skelos armor. Esoteric artifacts. Eh. Song of Iron. I don't know which boss dropped this. All the others are scout reports that I've been gathering. Hmm. Tablet of power. Have to be level 60 to use it. No oh, man, otherwise I would have gotten quite a few feats already. Okay. Song of Iron. This one's. I don't think this one's from the base game, is it? Okay, I'm gonna go give the uh, scout reports and get back. some runs and get back shall we so let me see if I'm able to get like a thrall or two of the running to do I'll do a dungeon run right now, but 
I'm just gonna go give the scout report and get back. But first, I need to place a wheel of pain. Hey, already the maelstrom started. Wheel of pain. 25 brick, 37 that. Look at that. How far was I running to reset it? How far did I run to reset it? I don't remember. Was it this far? Let me check. this far but they reset oh what no what this far then
Wait, they don't reset up until here also? It's weird. How far do I need to go to reset them? I forgot how far this was. Reset. level 2 I mean this far to reset it I don't know that was an archer level 2 Wait, they didn't reset. Still the archer level 2 itself. Huh, they didn't reset. Okay. What if I went around this place? That's actually way too far, to be honest. What if I went around this place? Nope, it doesn't reset them. Huh. Okay, what about over here? I think I remember now I used to come up till here then again go back oh man this one's a bit too far away for a reset or a respawn situation I won't be able to Sit still. Seriously? Well, Oivin the. Oivin is there. Oivin the cursed fighter. Okay. There's also a triple skull boss here. I could drag that boss here to this camp. Fighter. Blacksmith level 3. Oh. On the level 3 blacksmith. Oi. Stop shooting my horse in the butt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm in trouble. I am in trouble. Whoa, that was a hard hit. I think I should get out of here right now. I don't want to take any chances. They're still following. They have quite a bit of... Uh, range of chase huh oh wait a minute they reset over here I think I have to come up to here to reset them so I think I'm not wrong if they reset if I came up till here then this should be a good spot go see if that's the length uh, at which they reset that would be good it's 
Still a level two, so let me see if oi wind is still there. If oi wind is still there, yep, oi wind is still there. I guess that doesn't reset it in any way. Yeah, how do I get the thralls then? Or do I go to that uh, guaranteed name thrall all the way at the top? Yeah. Well, I guess not. Anyways, uh, I better get out of here. gonna be a long way actually I'll do this tomorrow I'll finish up for today I'll get back to my base and finish up for today tomorrow is going to be a long journey all the way towards the other side and some dungeon runs tomorrow today I'll just leave it at this for now I didn't waste uh, the wheel of pain. To use it properly tomorrow. I have to see where else I can get some name thralls other than that one spot. Problem is that one spot has uh, the Yakith demon dogs that might get me into trouble. Uh, for now, I'll finish up and uh, shout out to Chris, shout out to Red. Um, who has joined us? Only Chris and Red joined us on the stream chat today. Uh, shout out to those of you who watch the streams anonymously as well. Thank you for watching. I'm finishing up for this stream. And I will catch up. Today was not much of a crazy adventure or whatever. It wasn't too entertaining, if you will. But yeah, for now, I think I'll just... kind of stay here. And I think I'll do a bit of a grind today to get my level up. Maybe find some gorillas nearby. In that direction. I'll be able to get my rank up. Once I get my rank up a little bit, I should be able to unlock a few things. But level 60 is what I'm kind of aiming for, but let's see. Let's see, let's see. I still have to rank you up and you and... You, you haven't even gotten one rank either. Okay. Still level 10. Wait, level 10? Agility. Okay. That, that helps. Well, anyways, that's about it for this particular stream. I will catch up tomorrow. Until then, a sayonara, a tata, a see you, and a bye bye. Uh, shout out to everyone who watches the streams later on as well. Thank you for watching. And uh, I'll try to make it a bit more entertaining tomorrow with the dungeon runs. But let's see. No guarantee that I might stream tomorrow either. You have four thralls named uh, Edge Smith. Oh, Edge Smith. I wanted an Edge Smith and Temper Smith, Keen Edge. Okay, I'm actually looking for uh, one of the thralls that's a Nordheimer. They're usually a Bladesmith. The Bladesmith has that extra damage for the weapon. So let's see. I'll try to get uh, some proper runs done tomorrow, dungeon and thralls. But. 
depends whether I might have some other plans tomorrow. But let's see. I'm probably gonna stream if I don't have any other plans, of course. But yeah, thank you again. And uh, let's finish up with a little bit of a dance. And yeah, again, thank you for joining the stream chat, Chris. Thank you for keeping me company. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. That's all. Please stay safe and always keep smiling. See you guys. Stay healthy. Ciao. I'm done.